Hi everybody, uh, today we're going to have a look at Park Assist. Uh, I've been promising to uh, do this video for quite some time. Uh, so we're going to use the Caravelle behind me. Uh, this has got Park Assist as standard on the Executive. Uh, unfortunately I've got no uh, Californias at the moment so uh, uh, I couldn't, uh, couldn't use that but the uh, vehicle is exactly the same. It's no different how it works on the California or whether it be a, uh, a Caravelle. Uh, so have a look at that in a moment and we'll show you how that Park Assist actually works. Give you an idea of what it actually uses on Park Assist. As you can imagine, it uses the parking sensors that's on the vehicle. So, for example, these sensors here. Uh, there's another one at the back of the vehicle. It's on here. So, as you're driving along, uh, you press the button on the dash, which we'll show you, um, and then it's monitoring the sides of the road for where you want it to actually go into a car park space. So, if you see one on the right, you see one on the left, for example, you can put the indicator on which you're going to do anyway because you want to inform the traffic around you that you're actually going to go into one of the spaces on either side uh, and then it comes upon the centre of the dash which we'll show you and it's going to indicate on your parking spaces where you actually are. Uh, so let's have a try of it now and we'll show you what it's like. So you're driving down the road, you've seen a car park space, press the parking button on here. Um, it'll show up on the dash. Uh, I'm pretty sure automatically it always puts you on to the uh, left hand side. Obviously if you want to move to the right you just indicate which side you want to go on. So you're indicating either to the right and it'll be looking on the right hand side or to the left. And then we just drive straight on. So I'm going to drive straight on now with it pressed. And I'm going to drive some past the cars. Empty space here. And uh, carrying on past these spaces here. And it's indicating to us that there's a space there to move into. So I pop it into reverse. Take your hands off the steering wheel. You still need to control the brake and the accelerator. You can see the steering wheel is now moving. Just keep going backwards slowly. It's going to bring us back into the space that's here. Now it's telling me now to move forward. So I'll just put it in there. It's going to readjust forward slightly. And there we are. We'll pop it into park. All done. So we press the button drive along, going to be looking for spaces, sorry. It's found a space for us, pop it into reverse, hands off the steering wheel, there you go. Keeping your foot on the brake if you need to so you can adjust your speed. Tell us to go forward, As easy as that. So that's Park Assist, uh, so you now know how, how Park Assist works. Obviously we've just done it in our car park here, uh, can't really be filming other people's cars getting in and out of car park spaces. So on the Ocean Park Assist is standard uh, and obviously you can upgrade it on the Coast models as well. Uh, I think it's quite a nice option, so it'd be interesting to know what you guys think. I hope you've enjoyed today's video, uh, if you have give us a thumbs up, give us a like as always. Uh, if you don't subscribe please subscribe and we'll see you next time.